Hey guys, the objective of this video is to show you the steps on how to solve this integral over here. We will be doing this by u substitution, where we let u equals to 1 plus the square root of x. If we find the u dx, the derivative of the square root of x, which is half times x to the negative half. Another way of writing this would be du dx equals to 1 on 2 times square root of x. So if we rewrite our integral, we have the integral of square root of u times dx. We want to find dx now, so we rearrange our equation that we found earlier. So just from simple rearranging, we have dx equals to 2 square root of x du. We will be plugging this into our integral over here. So u times dx, which is 2 square root of x du. Now, as you can see, we still have an x here. We don't want that. So by rearranging this equation up here, all we do is subtract 1 from both sides. So we isolate the square root of x to u minus 1. So we have the square root of x equals to u minus 1. So we plug this into our integral, we have 2u minus 2 after timesing it by 2 du. Since now everything is in terms of u, we can just integrate it. But first of all, let's get rid of the brackets. So we have square root of u times 2u would be 2u to the power of 3 over 2 minus by 2 times the square root of u, which can be written as u to the power of half. Now we can integrate, so 2u raised to the power by 1 would be 5 on 2 and divide by the new power. Minus by 2u again raised to the power by 1 would be 3 on 2 divide by a new power plus c. So 2 divided by 5 on 2 is the same thing as 2 times 2 fifths. So we have 4 fifths of u, 5 on 2, minus by 2 times 2 thirds would be minus 4 on 3, u on 3, 2, plus c. And our last step is to replace the u's with 1 plus square root of x. So we have 4 fifths times 1 plus square root of x 5 on 2 minus by 4 thirds times 1 plus square root of x 3 on 2 plus c and that's the answer